This last one's for my sister. Dara Pod, she's a total asshole. Um, but when she was younger, even though she turned out into being a total asshole and had to divorce her fucking stupid ass as a family member, who's had to divorce a family member? Who had people go, you're gonna feel really bad about how you may die. And it's like, you know how hard it is? or to help them stop treating you like shit, or your, or your other relatives like shit, or, I don't know, dropping your sister off for a weekend to get raped to pay off the debt, stuff like that. You have to kick certain people out of your family. And sometimes it's somebody who's been victimized and now is re-victimizing others. And it's really hard because you know the, the score, you know what happened, and you're like, I feel for that person, I grew up with that person but they are ruining my motherfucking life. Like a fucking... And you gotta, you gotta let them go. I had to go through so much therapy to be like cool with that. And I had so many people tell me that when I like kind of divorced my dad and my sister that I was really gonna regret it. Best decision I ever made. <laughs> many, many fathers and many, many sisters. And I still love my, my, my biological family from afar, you know? And I can love them from over here without getting messed up in their business. But my sister did do one very cool thing when she was young. Um, this is sad, she got constantly fucking harassed. Um, constantly. And it's not because she had big boobs, but she had really big boobs from a really young age. And that shouldn't be a calling card for like grown men to be like, get in my car, get in my car. But from the time she was in the sixth grade, it was just constant, like everywhere we went, we'd go into a restaurant and like full grown men would like turn their chairs around to stare at her. No, it was like, I mean, it was like going out to eat with Brooke Shields. It was, it was weird. And, and it's not because she was pretty, it's not because, it's just because men can be gross. Which is what I want to say to the men here tonight, Please talk to your friends, and, and if they're doing shit like that, like, say something. Like, they don't listen to me. They really, they won't listen, they won't listen. A lot of men who are like that won't listen to me, or, or whatever, you know what I'm saying. But my sister finally at one point came up with this saying that she would yell back um, at guys when they yelled at her. And this is our last song, it's called Suck My Left One. <laughs> 